So you want to know how to pump. Today I'm with the crazy Russian hacker and today we're going to show you pranks you can pull on your friends and family. Let's do it. Okay, we got a drink in the can right here uh, and we got a little thumbtack. It's going to make this can leak so whenever someone goes to drink it, it's going to dribble all over them. So you pop one right above the or like this. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> okay, okay, there is a little pump for yourself first of all. But that's okay, it didn't spill out that much. <laughs> And it's so small, you can't even see it. Two little holes right there, one, two. You wanna add another one or is that good? One more real one. So this works best when their can is already open. You're gonna put those three little holes in with a thumbtack. Let's see what it looks like. Oh! That's awesome. So they're gonna be like, whoa, what's going on? And it will drive them nuts. So what do you think, Ross? What do you think about this one? I love it. I didn't even think of that. It's so simple and innocent. And they'll be like, oh, how am I missing a hole? Make sure their drink is open. Throw a couple thumbtack holes, back up, and watch them dribble their soda all over their chin. <laughs> <Funny. laughs> Smell it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a good one. I didn't expect that at all. <laughs> I you wanna see how I did it? I think it's better if you had a flower. Well, though. I couldn't find a flower. I looked everywhere in here for a flower. Yeah. All right, so this is the flower spray prank, or I guess you could use anything pretty much, but it's really tough to do. It's a little bit challenging, but you gotta get yourself a little water balloon. You fill up this balloon with water, and then you're gonna put it right between your knuckles, like this. So you got this water balloon in your hand, and this is the flower spray prank. So you're gonna take this balloon like this, and you're gonna hold it between these knuckles here. If you do it right here, it won't spray this well. Well, no. If you hold it here, it's it just skin. Stuff. It's oh, gonna explode out. Yeah. This one, you got these tight bones right there. You can pinch it shut. It's a little messy, you know. Mm -hmm. and you're gonna have to like kind of. If you got small hands, it's gonna be tough. Now you get a flower, preferably, and you're gonna stick it to the part right there. Dude, this is a good one. Then you go up to somebody, you hold your flower right here, right? And you're like, hey, you wanna smell this? Or whatever, it's come up with a reason for them to smell it. And when they go down to smell it, you just squeeze the bottom of your hand right here. Whoa, that's crazy. It's spraying. sprayed so far. This is awesome. <laughs> I know. For this part, that's a really good one. I've never seen that before. So what you do is take off a few chips for yourself. Get whipped cream and pour it inside of the bag. Yeah, all inside the bag. There's... I like what you did there because you put it, I put it on the top all the way across. Uh -huh. You have it half, so you know where to go. You can still grab a good chip. Yeah, that's, that's, a, good that's a good idea. Look, this is what he's talking about. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> So your friend coming over, your punk is ready to go, you have a clean side, you take out, Yo, pretend Tomas, that you what's sit. up man, I love these chips. Oh bro. yeah, you want some? Yeah. Mango. Oh. oh, what the heck dude? You got <laughs> that. That's an innocent and easy one, I love yeah, that. Yeah, this is a good one to pull in friends and family, they'll never expect it and they can't get mad because it's whipped cream. You might be getting slapped in the face with the whipped cream though. <laughs> Welcome to my house. All right, for this prank, you're gonna put a fake rat inside your friend's shoe. Rats inside, you can't tell there's a rat inside. And they put that on and they're like, oh, it's in there. Come on, look, pull that, oh! You know what's funny, when we were at the store, one girl freaked out, thinking I was holding a real mouse. Yeah, she thought it was a real mouse when you were holding it like this. She's like, oh no, not a mouse. I really like this prank because especially those people who are afraid of all those little critters and bugs, they're gonna reach in. What is this? A sock in there? Like, oh, oh, look at that little guy. I'm always afraid around here. I have so many snakes. I always look in the shoes if they've been outside. Yeah. Because I always worry there's gonna be a giant spider or a snake. Yeah, some people live. Let me know in the comments below if you live in a place where you gotta watch out for the scorpions, the spiders, the snakes, even the little mice that are in your shoe. Because look, this is a cool home for this little guy. He'd love to live in there. There, now it's inside that shoe. No one's gonna tell. They can't put the shoe on when they put their foot inside. Wow, this is what's gonna come out. Well, for this prank, it's gonna be pretty good. So, oh, hold on. <coughs> Something wrong. Oh, oh man. No, that just awesome. came out for me. 
All we need is flour and a spoon. That's it. So you take a flour. It really works if you have big hands like Don't do a lot. I only did a little bit. Put it in there. That's it. It's even too much That's here. That's it? Yeah, very little bit. A little bit, huh? Yeah. That's all you need. And you're like, Mom, I don't feel good. Something's like in my chest. What's wrong, dear? What's happening? <laughs> they will be like, whoa! They'll be so startled. It's yeah. like so exciting. So yeah. This is a good one. I really love this it's one. Super easy. Let us know what you think about it in the comments below. This is the next prank. It's gonna be the big bang boom prank. Basically, you tie a bunch of rope to loud pots and pans. And we're only doing this door as a demo. You should do like a bedroom door, someone sleeping, so when they open the